This week I made a lot of solo beats, so I want to kind of show you guys what the process was like. I feel like I made melodies in a different way than I usually do. So um, this is like how to make fire melodies in a unique way and finish the beat by yourself type stuff. All the kits I'll be using will be available on Secret Audio. I mean, the Euro kit, uh, the Lizzie Stash kit right here, and the Linguini one shots, and my Tricky Beats 2024 kit. I just downloaded Absent, which was random. I just checked my native instrument shit and I saw that I hadn't downloaded this. So just downloaded it. And what I started doing was linking it to a mixer channel, just being in Edison and just recording everything. So now we can just like play around with certain sounds and then just see what we kind of like. And then it's recorded, you know. I'm going to speed it up a little bit, maybe like 170. Feeling like faster bounces recently. So I'm just gonna like really just play and listen for something that just triggers my... It's so detuned though, like, but like I hear it, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's already recorded, so let's see. That's what's fire about it. It's like you're recording a live synth, you know what I'm saying? know what I'm saying like now just what tempo is this because it's not 170 yeah it's fire let's see if this is in a certain key or if it's detuned let, let, let me just like put the key note next to it tune the piano up to what it is and then tune down the sample you know It's about 30 cents so i gotta pitch it down 30 cents you know what i'm saying like so i link that to like a separate mixer channel and then uh i just go back into absent and continue recording you know so we just like clear the edison and just record again and then just play over it you know yeah that last part was fire i don't know like i could use it could not use it you know but it, it was like a unique sound i liked it so i gotta uh, record it I can hear I can hear something I can hear like a Rhodes melody under it so I'm gonna play that with a Linguini one shot uh, maybe I'm gonna play it with this and then replace it by this <laughs> I just like playing it with the other one Thank you. 
like fill in the chords. Yeah, that goes crazy with the with the original melodies. So let's layer them over each other and let's put this uh, in like a um, reverb hall, so it's like nice and real. notes under it to like enhance this it's kind of kind of like gotta listen for it kind of like really blend it to how you hear it This close to where I hear it. I want to kind of add a bass to like show you what I'm, what I'm on. So one thirty. So I got a minus two, three. So minus three thirty-five. Uh -huh. Yeah.
crazy. All right. So now let's add um like uh, some open heads. Uh, like one open head from my kit that I kind of want to add, which is this spin back one. I'm going to put it on stretch so I can have one high and one low, but they play in the same tempo. questions like Fire, we got it like we got a fire, unique type of texture and beat going on, you know what I'm saying? Like, right now, what I want to do is kind of arrange it, it's gonna definitely come in like this. Uh, let's see what is the
right now is in this first height pattern and remove the rolls. like that it's like is this the main sound yeah it is i feel like maybe this gotta go to this chain yeah Yeah, now it really feels like one sample because they're both going to that room. Yeah. This part is crazy. Crazy. Ah, right, yeah, that's the beat. Uh, I hope you learned something about creating unique melodies and unique beats. And I hope this beat is not too weird to post. So I'm going to see you after. If I used it, fire. Kits on Secret Audio. All kits I use on Secret Audio are available right now, bro. Let's get it.